The Bear County Commissioner's Court has authorized the DA's office to hire a law firm to explore a legal challenge to rules that are recently proposed by Attorney General Ken Paxton. Those rules would require extensive reporting and significant detail on individual cases prosecuted by the DA's office, and it would cost taxpayers around $1 million. USAA has laid off another 220 employees in at least its sixth round of job cuts in the past two years. It's unclear how many of those employees were based here in San Antonio. USAA reported its first annual loss in a century in 2022, the same year they vacated more than 500,000 square feet of office space downtown. By the end of 2024, Texas drivers could be sharing the road with driverless trucks. Such autonomous trucks are already operating in Austin with plans of expanding statewide.